Hey Aquarius, welcome to May. So, I feel like okay, a lot of you could be single and could be looking or are just kind of like in a whatever type of mood. Yeah, King of Swords, you're completely in your energy right off the bat. I feel like you've been working really hard just to get back into your energy for the past like year. Like, let's just be real. It's been a while. Okay. A lot of cards went down. Let's see. Universe, can I get more for Aquarius? Sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. Get it more for Aquarius. Page of Cups. Okay, yeah. Could be an offer coming. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Universe, can I get more? This could be some good news about something. Okay. Can I get more for Aquarius? Sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. All right, you have the Knight of Pentacles, the Knight of Swords in reverse, and the Six of Cups. Okay, so an ex could be coming in slowly, or an old friend. Maybe you were feeling a little in your head about a friendship situation or an ex-partner. But with the King of Swords, I feel like you are completely prepared to use your sword. Like, I really don't think you're going to hesitate to cut anybody out of your life at this point. Oh, let's see. Ten of Swords, yeah. You you went from the nine to the ten, so you dropped it. You, whatever it is, you're dropping it. Universe, clarify. Oh, you know what? I'm going to get some more cards. Hold on. Let's just get three more cards. Universe, can I get three more cards for Aquarius? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. I get three more cards for Aquarius. This one, Seven of Swords, okay. Something maybe didn't go as planned. Maybe a relationship. You anticipated it to go a certain way, and it um, absolutely didn't. Okay. Or maybe you weren't expecting this ex to show up like they did. Maybe they already did come and show up in your life. And maybe you don't know what to do about that. Can I get more for Aquarius? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. The Empress card, okay. So, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Earth sign. You got the Knight of Pentacles here as well. Strong Taurus, Libra vibes with the Empress. And you also have, okay, so I feel like once you put a death to something, could be with a fire sign, um, Aries, Leo, Sag, you get victory uh, with something else. So, yeah, you got the Six of Wands there with the Death card. Ooh, and the Lover's card. Okay, so maybe by the middle of May, you will be getting, you'll be choosing, I feel like you're going to choose somebody. I think you do have options here. I think you are going to choose one of these options. One could be a Gemini. Any sign, really, but strong Gemini, strong Taurus vibes. But you could be reconnecting with old friends or reconnecting with friends. Verify. Let's see. Clarify the Page of Cups. Okay. King of Wands just showed itself to me. Could be from a fire sign. Maybe you're friends with a fire sign and now they want to make you an offer of some sort. Universe, clarify the Page of Cups. You could be dealing with a Pisces person. You could have Pisces in your chart. Oh, okay. So one of these offers is the devil. Could just be simply from a Captain Corn, or one of these offers is going to be toxic. I feel like one of these offices is going to be toxic. One of these offices is coming, on, coming in slow. And that could be the lover here. Yeah. Okay. So the one that comes in just like all happy and all like, let's be together. Let's... No. Clarify the devil card. Universe, clarify the devil card. They might just be looking at you to for stability or something like that. That's a very codependent energy. Yeah, they could bring burdens. Or maybe this is what you're letting go of. You're letting go of this devil energy, overspending, um, codependency addictions. You could be letting go of that. But if this is an offer from a person, it's just going to bring burdens from this um, page of cups. Okay, so clarify the Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, you have the offer coming in slowly. Let's see what that's about. Okay justice so it could 
very well balance out your life. You could be going through some kind of court system and maybe it's slowly, I feel like it is going in your favor, but it's going really slow. So if this is a court situation, could be a Libra, but I do feel like this, this person is more reliable. The Knight of Pentacles is reliable. So I do think that there, if this is a relationship offer that it could be a good one. Okay. Well, yeah, you are feeling in the Nine of Swords about walking away from something. Maybe somebody walked away from you or you walked away from somebody. Universe, clarify the, the Eight of Cups. Clarify the Eight of Cups for Aquarius. Universe. Clarify the Eight of Cups. Got the Nine of Pentacles again, so. Yeah, you could have walked away from an Earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Strong Taurus here. Yeah, and you're you're coming out of feeling bad about it. I want to say, yeah, I don't think you feel so bad anymore. Because maybe it was the right thing to do. I don't know. Now, let's see. Why is the Six of Cups here? Maybe an ex reached out to you. But, yeah, if this page of cups is the ex, the situation is still toxic. So let's see. Why is the Six of Cups here? Universe, why is the Six Okay. Queen of Swords. Sorry, ran out of space. Okay, so anyway. You have the Strength card clarifying the Six of Cups with the Queen of Swords. This is you needing to be strong. I feel like mentally strong when this person comes back. Like, stand your ground. I'm getting with that for sure. Because, yeah, I think finally, like, once and for all, you guys are going to resolve this issue with the Ten of Swords here. So, let's see. Clarify the Knight of Swords. Maybe you guys are going to talk about what didn't go wrong and, like, maybe try to get on some common ground here. Whether you guys get back together or not, I think you guys are going to try to get on some, like, balance. The Justice cards here. You're going to try to balance out the situation. Why is the Seven of Swords here? Universe, why is the Seven of Swords here? For Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, signs. why is the Seven of Swords here? This one. Hmm, okay. Two of Pentacles, so maybe you thought this was going to balance out your life. This person was going to balance out your life, and they didn't. So, you could, yeah, you could be holding on to your ex. Your ex is really holding on to you. And that is, that's why you guys need to speak about this situation, because you guys could be holding on to each other. And that's really putting a pause on you guys moving forward in your individual lives if that's what you want or even a life together so i think that's what you guys need to figure out if you want a life together or if you want to go your separate ways okay here let's clarify the empress you definitely could be dealing with the taurus clarify the empress maybe you have kids with this person will of fortune okay so this could possibly go well with the wheel here could possibly go well and you have the lovers here as well so this is good energy here you guys just need to talk about the seven of swords and why it didn't work out you need to talk about it and figure it out okay why is the lovers card here for aquarius universe why is the lovers card here for aquarius why is the lovers card here for aquarius oh okay the lovers again so it could be a gemini this could be, okay, maybe you guys are going to, like, have sex. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it's been a long time. <laughs> and, yeah, the, the lovers clarifying the lovers. That's just, like, well, there it is. Okay. So you guys definitely do have a very strong connection. Could be a very strong sexual connection as well. So let's get some advice for you guys regarding this spread. Universe, what's the advice for Aquarius regarding this spread? Sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs for May. What's the advice for Aquarius? The high refine. Yeah, strong Taurus vibes. King of Fire. Whatever you need to do, do it. Because King of Fire definitely does what he needs to do. So yeah. Maybe get if you want some advice, maybe take advice from a fire sign. Maybe they know what they're talking about. If you have a friend, Aries Leo Sag. Yeah, and the nine of water, it's gonna lead to um it's going to lead to happiness and emotional fulfillment once you guys talk it out 
you know, maybe they have fire in their chart. Talk to them. Do what you need to do to make this work because they are. You guys do have a strong connection and you guys could possibly have kids together. So, yeah. Talk to this Taurus person if you're dealing with a Taurus. But be abundant. Take care of yourself. For sure. Like, this is only the Nine of Cups. So definitely take care of yourself. If you guys are single right now, you do need to go nurture yourself. So, yeah. Anyway. So I hope this was a good reading for you guys. Um, if you would like a personal reading, there is information in the description box on how you can get one. So, yeah. Enjoy your May.